picture a force, invisible yet omnipresent, shaping the course of everything around us. Welcome to the world of dimensions. We often think of dimensions in terms of length, width, and height, the physical parameters that define the space we live in. But this is just the tip of the iceberg. Dimensions run much deeper, encompassing the orderliness and interrelations of things in the universe. Let's break it down. The concept of dimensions is not merely about physical space. It's about how things are arranged and how they relate to each other. It's like a cosmic dance where everything is in synchrony, adhering to patterns and rules defined by these dimensions. Take a moment to consider this. You are living in a multi-dimensional universe right now. Yes, you heard it right. Each moment, every event, every decision you make is influenced by these dimensions. It's a beautifully complex system where everything is intertwined. But what exactly are these dimensions? Let's start with the basics. The first three dimensions are the ones we are most familiar with, length, width, and height. These are the dimensions of space that define our physical world. Beyond that, things get a bit more abstract. The fourth dimension is time, which governs the progression of events. Beyond that, dimensions become more theoretical, involving concepts like alternate realities, parallel universes, and even different laws of physics. But why should we care about these higher dimensions? Well, Understanding dimensions can provide us with a deeper understanding of the universe and our place within it. It can open up new possibilities for technological advancement and give us a whole new perspective on life. Now it's time for us to delve deeper into this fascinating world. Let's unfold the mystery of each dimension, one layer at a time. Let's explore how each of these dimensions shapes our reality and how they could potentially shape our future. So buckle up as we embark on this awe-inspiring journey through the dimensions. Imagine a world with only one direction, forward and backward. Welcome to the world of one dimension. Now this might be a little hard to grasp at first, but bear with me. We're diving into a realm where length is the sole property, a world that's as straight as a pin and as slender as a thread. In this one dimensional world, there's no up, no down, no left, no right. There's only forward and backward. You can think of it like a line, a single continuous thread that stretches indefinitely. Everything in this world exists on this line, moving along it, living in it, and experiencing life as a sequence of moments, one after another. Life in a one-dimensional world would be fundamentally different from what we're used to. Let's take a creature living in this world, for instance. It wouldn't have a top or bottom, a front or back. It would be just a point on the line moving forward or backward. It wouldn't see or perceive the world as we do. Instead, its entire universe would be a series of points along the line, Communication in this world would also be a linear affair. Messages would be sent one after another, not simultaneously. And there would be no way to pass someone without colliding since there's no other direction to move in. However, it's important to remember that this is all hypothetical. Our brains, accustomed to three dimensions, can find it challenging to fully comprehend a one-dimensional existence. But beef thought experiments can expand our understanding of the universe, pushing the boundaries of what we consider possible. In a world of one dimension, life sure would be quite a different experience. And while we may not fully grasp this different experience, it's an intriguing step in our journey through the dimensions. So buckle up, because next we're adding another dimension into the mix. And things are only going to get more interesting from here. Adding another dimension, we step into the world of two dimensions. Here we're not just moving forward and backward, we also have the freedom to move up and down. This two-dimensional plane might seem simple, but it's a considerable leap from the solitary line of one dimension. Think of a piece of paper. It is a perfect example of a two-dimensional object. You can move along the length of the paper, you can move along the breadth of it, but you can't move up or down because there's no thickness. This is the world of two dimensions, length and breadth, but nil height. Now, what would life be like in this two-dimensional plane? Well, it would certainly be a different experience from what we're used to in our three-dimensional world. For instance, imagine a two-dimensional creature living in this flat world. It would have a very different perspective of its surroundings. It could see around itself, but not over or under objects. It could move in any direction on the flat surface, but not up into the air or down into the ground. So its world would be a flat panorama without any depth. Interestingly, the concept of two dimensions isn't just a theoretical construct. It has practical applications in various fields, from mathematics to computer graphics. In fact, every time you watch a movie or play a video game, you're interacting with a two-dimensional representation of a three-dimensional world. In the world of two dimensions, the possibilities begin to expand. We've moved from a straight line to a flat plane. 
and with that comes a whole new range of possibilities. But this is just the beginning. As we'll see, the world of dimensions has much more to offer. So let's move on and explore the familiar territory of three dimensions. Jumping to three dimensions, welcome to the world we know. This is where complexity takes a leap, and life as we understand it begins to take shape. In this realm, we are no longer confined to the straight path of one dimension or the flat plane of two dimensions. Here we have forward and backward, up and down, left and right, and it's these three dimensions that shape our perception of the world around us. Every object we interact with, every movement we make, exists within these three dimensions. The buildings we live and work in, the cars we drive, the food we eat, even the bodies we inhabit, all are three-dimensional structures. We navigate through this world instinctively, moving freely in any direction we choose. This is the world we were born into, the world we have evolved to understand, but it's not just our physical world that's influenced by three dimensions. Our very understanding of reality is shaped by them. They help us interpret the world, providing a framework for us to make sense of everything we see, hear, touch, and experience. We measure the world in three dimensions, using them to define space and quantify our surroundings. Yet while we may find comfort in the familiarity of three dimensions, they are not the limit of our universe. Scientists and mathematicians have theorized about the existence of dimensions beyond the three Lee experience, dimensions that could hold the key to understanding the deepest mysteries of our universe. So, as we journey further into the realm of dimensions, let's not forget the world we know. It's the foundation upon which we build our understanding, the starting point from which we embark on this fascinating journey. In the world of three dimensions, we find comfort in familiarity, but as we'll soon discover, there's so much more to explore. So buckle up, as the adventure is just beginning. Venturing into the fourth dimension, we encounter the concept of time. This invisible force governs all. It keeps the universe ticking in perfect synchrony, from the rotations of galaxies to the beating of our hearts. In the realm of three dimensions, we perceive time as a constant forward march. We remember the past within the present and anticipate the future. But what if we could manipulate this fourth dimension as easily as we do the other three? What if we could stretch time, squeeze it, or even reverse its flow? Imagine a world where time is tangible. You could stroll through your past, revisit your fondest memories, or even catch a glimpse of your future. You could stretch out the joyous moments, making them last forever and squeeze the painful ones, reducing them to mere instants. But here's a twist. If time becomes more like space and we can move around in it at will, then what becomes of cause and effect? If you can visit the future and return to the present, could you change the outcome of events? This introduces the mind-bending concept of time paradoxes. Now let's take a step back. We're not quite there yet. Our understanding of time is still evolving. Today, we perceive time as a one-way street, always moving forward. But who knows what revelations the future may hold? As we delve deeper into the fourth dimension, we begin to see that time is not just a mere leisure of events. Instead, it's a dynamic entity, a dimension in its own right, intertwined with the fabric of space in a cosmic dance choreographed by the laws of physics. In the end, grappling with the fourth dimension expands our understanding of the universe and our place within it. It challenges our perceptions, pushing the boundaries of our understanding and inviting us to think in ways we never thought possible. In the realm of the fourth dimension, time holds the key. And as we unlock its secrets, we inch closer towards a fuller understanding of the cosmos. So, buckle up for the journey ahead, because time, as they say, waits for no one. Moving into the fifth dimension, we introduce the concept of probability. Fifth dimension, rather than adding another spatial direction or temporal flow, adds an entirely new layer of complexity to our understanding of the universe. Imagine a world where not just one outcome, but multiple possibilities coexist. This is the realm of the fifth dimension. It's a world that isn't governed by the linear progression of time or the confinement of space, but by the endless possibilities of what could be. In the fifth dimension, we're no longer just moving forward in time, but also branching out into different possibilities. Each of these branches represents a different outcome of a specific event. Think of it like a crossroads, where each path leads to a different destination. But instead of having to choose just one in the fifth dimension, we can explore all of them. In a way, the fifth dimension is like an enormous library, filled with books that tell every possible story of your life. Each book represents a different sequence of events, a different path you could take. 
One book might tell the story of your life if you decided to become a doctor, while another might tell a story where you became an artist. The possibilities are endless, and they're all happening simultaneously in the fifth dimension. But while this concept can be mind-boggling, it also offers a fascinating perspective on the nature of our reality. It suggests that our universe is not just a single thread of events, but a rich tapestry woven from countless threads of possibilities. So, what does this mean for us? Well, it means that our lives are not just a series of events dictated by the laws of physics and the passage of time. Instead, our lives are an intricate web of possibilities, each influenced by our decisions, our actions, and even our thoughts. In the world of the fifth dimension, nothing is certain. But in this uncertainty lies the beauty of infinite possibilities, the freedom to explore different paths, and the wonder of endless potential. In the sixth dimension, we encounter parallel universes. Now I know what you're thinking, parallel universes? You mean like in the movies? Well, not quite, but let's dive in to explore this intriguing concept. Remember the fifth dimension where probabilities ruled? The sixth dimension takes it a step further. It's not just about probabilities anymore, it's about possible realities. A reality where you chose to wear a different shirt today, a reality where you woke up five minutes later, or even a world where dinosaurs never went extinct. Think of it this way. If the fifth dimension is a river with numerous tributaries representing different outcomes of the same event, the sixth dimension is a vast ocean containing all possible rivers, all possible tributaries, all possible realities. In essence, it's a dimension filled with an infinite number of fifth dimensional probability trees. But here's where it gets even more mind boggling. The sixth dimension doesn't just house parallel universes based on different outcomes of events in our own universe. It also includes universes that follow entirely different laws of physics. Universes where gravity repels instead of attracts, or where time runs backward. It's a thought that's as fascinating as it is perplexing. So how does this all tie into our everyday lives? Well, every choice we make, no matter how insignificant, could potentially create a new universe in the fixed dimension. That's right. The mundane decision of picking a coffee over a tea could be creating an entirely separate universe where you chose tea instead. But before you get lost in the cosmic significance of your breakfast choices, remember that this is all theoretical. While the idea of parallel universes in the sixth dimension is compelling, it remains a concept in the realm of high-level physics and mathematical models. Yet, it's a concept that inspires us to reflect on the power of choice and the infinite possibilities that may lie beyond our perception. In the sixth dimension, every choice creates a new universe. As we continue our journey, the dimensions keep unfolding. The seventh dimension, for instance, is a world of infinite possibilities. Here, every decision you make, every path you choose, is not just a single event, but an entire universe of its own, each branching out into an infinite number of different outcomes. It's a realm where the concept of choice takes on a whole new meaning. Now, imagine venturing into the eighth dimension. Here, we're no longer just dealing with the physical and temporal, but also with the conceptual. It's a place where ideas and reality intertwine, where every thought and every concept have its own universe. It's as if every idea you've ever had, every dream you've ever dreamt, exists in its own reality. And then there's the ninth dimension. Here, we start to delve into the realms of the abstract and the metaphysical, where concepts like consciousness and existence take on an entirely new perspective. It's a place where the line between the physical and the metaphysical begins to blur, where existence is as much about perception as it is about reality. Each new dimension we encounter broadens our understanding of the universe and our place within it. They challenge our perceptions, our beliefs, and our understanding of reality. They invite us to question, to explore, and to imagine. They remind us that the universe is more complex, more mysterious, and more beautiful than we could ever comprehend. And yet, even as we ascend through the dimensions, we realize that our journey is far from over. There are still more dimensions to explore, more mysteries to unravel, and more wonders to behold. And as we continue to ascend, we find that the higher we go, the more there is to discover. As we ascend further, the dimensions only get more intriguing. The universe, it seems, is far from done surprising us. So let's keep exploring, let's keep questioning, and let's keep journeying through the dimensions. Because who knows what wonders await us in the dimensions yet to come. Finally, we arrive at the 11th dimension, the realm of the almost unimaginable. This is where the magic of quantum physics and string theory comes into play. The 11th dimension is not a spatial dimension as we understand it, 
but it is a theoretical dimension that could exist according to some scientists. Descartes, the renowned French philosopher and mathematician, proposed the existence of multiple dimensions, up to 11. His theories, while intellectual conjecture, have shaped the way we view our universe and our place within it. Today, these theories are being tested and expanded upon by modern physicists, who are using cutting-edge technology and complex mathematical models to unlock the secrets of the universe. Now you might ask, what could possibly exist in the 11th dimension? Well, the answer is both simple and complex. The 11th dimension could contain all possible universes with all possible laws of physics. In this context, different universes could coexist, each with different dimensions and different laws of physics. This concept is mind-boggling, but it also opens up endless possibilities. If the 11th dimension does exist, it could explain many of the mysteries that have puzzled scientists for decades. It could provide a framework for the unification of quantum physics and general relativity, two of the pillars of modern physics that until now have been incompatible. But the journey doesn't end here. The exploration of dimensions is a continuous process. Scientists are tirelessly working to discover if there are more dimensions that we have yet to understand. With each new discovery, we are getting closer to understanding the fundamental nature of reality itself. In the 11th dimension, we stand on the brink of the unknown. It's a place of infinite possibilities, where our understanding of the universe is constantly being challenged and expanded. As we continue to explore, we are not just learning about our universe, but also about ourselves and our place in this vast cosmic landscape. While we live in a three-dimensional world, the influence of dimensions is far-reaching. You may think that the concept of dimensions only applies to the grand scale of the cosmos, but it's much closer to home than you might think. In fact, dimensions play a vital role in the way we perceive and navigate our everyday lives. Take, for instance, the concept of time, our fork dimension. We may not see it, but we feel its effects every second. From the moment we wake up until we lay our heads to rest, we're constantly racing against it, planning around it and making decisions based on it. It's a dimension that adds depth to our existence, shaping the rhythm of our lives. Now let's add probability, the fifth dimension, into the mix. Every choice we make, every risk we take, they all exist within the realm of possibilities. Each decision branches out into different potential outcomes, creating a tree of probabilities. This dimension adds a layer of uncertainty to our lives, making each day a new adventure. The sixth dimension, parallel universes, is a bit more abstract. It suggests that for every choice we make, there exists a universe where we made a different decision. It's a mind-boggling concept, but it puts into perspective the weight and significance of our choices. Understanding these dimensions can help us see life from a broader perspective. It allows us to appreciate the complexity and beauty of existence. It reminds us that we're not just beings moving in space, but also in time, in probabilities, and perhaps across multiple realities. So, while we may be living in a three-dimensional world, we're actually interacting with multiple dimensions in one way or another. These dimensions, though unseen and unfelt, shape our lives in profound ways, adding depth, uncertainty, and infinite possibilities to our existence. Dimensions, though invisible, shape our lives in profound ways. As we look towards the future, the dimensions hold many promises. The concept of dimensions once relegated to the realm of abstract mathematics, is now at the forefront of our understanding of the universe. The future is ripe with the potential of technologies that may allow us to perceive and perhaps even manipulate higher dimensions. Indeed, as our knowledge of dimensions deepens, we might find ourselves on the precipice of a new era. Just as the shift from a flat Earth to a spherical one revolutionized navigation, so too could the ability to perceive higher dimensions revolutionize our understanding of space-time. Imagine the possibilities. Higher dimensions could offer us new ways to comprehend the universe, to understand the very fabric of reality. It could change the way we think about everything from physics to philosophy, from how we navigate space to how we perceive time. But it's not just about understanding the universe. The potential for practical applications is staggering. Higher dimensional technologies could lead to advances in fields as diverse as quantum computing, communication technologies, and even medicine. Consider the implications for artificial intelligence. With the ability to perceive and operate in higher dimensions, AI could evolve in ways we can't yet imagine. Or think about virtual reality. VR could become not just a tool for entertainment, 
but a tool for exploring and interacting with higher dimensions. And let's not forget about space travel. Manipulating higher dimensions could be the key to faster than like travel, opening up the universe for exploration in ways we could only dream of. The road to these breakthroughs is long and filled with challenges. But if history has taught us anything, it's that our capacity to overcome obstacles is only limited by our imagination. The journey into higher dimensions is a journey into the unknown, a journey that promises to redefine our understanding of the universe. In the future, dimensions hold the key to unprecedented insights. And while the path forward may be fraught with challenges, the rewards promise to be nothing short of extraordinary. As we conclude our journey, the dance with dimensions has only just begun. We've traversed from the singular light of one dimension through the plane of two dimensions and ventured into the familiar territory of three dimensions. We've grappled with the elusive concept of time as the fourth dimension and entertained the idea of probability as the fifth. Our minds have been stretched to consider parallel universes in the sixth dimension and beyond, all the way up to the theoretical limit of the eleventh dimension. In this vast multi-dimensional cosmos, we've discovered that dimensions are not limited to physical spaces, but encompass order and relation in a universal context. They give shape to our understanding of the world, from the microscopic to the cosmic scale, influencing everything from the structure of our bodies to the trajectory of the universe. In the one-dimensional world, we encountered a universe of simplicity and linearity, where entities exist in a single, straightforward path. Adding another dimension, we explored the plane of two dimensions, where up and down joined the concept of forward and backward, giving birth to a whole new realm of possibilities. The leap to the three-dimensional world brought us into familiar territory. Here, we saw how the addition of depth, the concept of left and right, influences our biological structures and social behaviors. In the fourth dimension, we contemplated time, considering what it would mean to compress or stretch it. The fifth dimension introduced us to the realm of probability, where the world is no longer deterministic, and myriad possibilities coexist. The sixth dimension opened our eyes to the concept of parallel universes, where each division creates a different branch of reality. But our journey didn't stop there. We ventured beyond into the seventh, eighth, ninth, and tenth dimensions, each one more abstract and harder to conceptualize than the last, culminating in the eleventh dimension, the theoretical limit according to some. Every step of this journey has revealed how the concept of dimensions permeates our everyday life. Our actions, decisions, and behaviors all take place across multiple dimensions whether we realize it or not. Understanding dimensions helps us better comprehend our existence. Looking to the future, we can only imagine how technology might allow us to perceive or even manipulate higher dimensions. Such advancements promise to provide unprecedented insights and revolutionize our understanding of the universe, Thank you for joining me on this fascinating journey through dimensions. Together, let's look forward to the wonders dimensions will unveil for us.